What's happening everyone? It's your boy KnowHow92 and today instead of Axe Infinity I'm gonna share a Splinterlands gameplay video. For those of you who don't know, Splinterlands is a card collectible game built upon Hive blockchain so it's a play to earn game just like Axe Infinity. Well, you don't get to earn a ton of money but you earn some super sweet uh, NFT cards. Each card well, as I told you, Splinterlands is a card game, so you get to use those cards too. You get to use your NFTs in battles. I'm gonna show you how a battle looks like uh, in uh, a minute. And yeah, uh, each card has a limited uh, printing number and supply. For example, uh, this card, the Wave Runner, its circulation is 4,301. There are only 4,300 uh, cards out there. I have one of them. And to get your hands on my wave runner, you've got to pay me at least two dollars and thirty cents. It's a free market game. I can list uh, my wave runner for sale or rent right now. I could sell this card for for all this USD. I'm sorry. <laughs> and yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how uh, Splinterlands cards uh, are. That's what they do. And let me show you how they work in battle. Uh, you can get your hands on those cards by completing daily quests and every 15 days, uh, depending on your rank, you earn season rewards. Well, uh, right now I'm at uh, bronze 1 tier, I need to get to silver 3, so let's battle. My daily quest is not available yet, it's gonna be in a little while, but I don't care about it right now, all I care is to grind the rank ladder. So my opponent likes to use the Life Splinter, 14 mana cap, Life Splinter and Water Splinter. I bet he's not gonna like what I'm about to do to him. I think these two cards, nah, quick combo. This one... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna use my Furious Chicken as my second card, the Iced Pixie, and I need to use two more cards. Where is it? There it is. The Enhanced, okay, Pirate Archer, and I think we're good to go, guys. I somehow think uh, this game will be my victory. I guess we've got to wait to find out. Okay. Oh shit. But it's over. GG. Fourteen uh, ranked points and 4.83 deck dark energy crystals this is the currency of splinterlands with dark energy crystals uh, you can go to the market and buy cards as well as go to the shop uh, and buy uh, packs which are right now currently sold out as well as dice these uh, dice and packs contain cards and that's pretty much it well, there's a lot of stuff going on on Splinterlands, I'm not here to explain everything. Uh, I'm gonna leave some links below so you can uh, find more about this game and I'm gonna leave a sign up link. So if you feel like joining Splinterlands, you can sign up through my referral link. So no armors, right? This means business. Nope. Damn, this is a tough fight. Okay, I'm gonna go hard. Yeah. 
I'm gonna go all in guys with just two monsters and see what's gonna go down. Monsters do not have armor, that's why I chose uh, two uh, melee attack monsters with big attack points, with high attack points, I'm sorry. I can output 5 damage every turn. My first monster has 12 health, right? Yeah, 12 health, so I can withstand a couple hits uh, every turn. Well, let's see how it goes. If my opponent decides to join the game, <laughs> that is. <clears throat> Come on, game. That's a default win. Okay, win streak, 50 points, I'll take it. 211 to silver 3, that's my goal for today. Reach silver 3 and, and stack some deck in the meantime. A thousand deck are worth one dollar. Uh, oh, seems like I've got a strong opponent. Okay, I'm gonna go with this, uh, yeah. Oh damn. No snipe, please. Okay, very nice. Oh, that's a blast. Okay, that's my win, GG. That was close. <laughs> Keep battling, of course. Okay, 15 mana cap. I need to make it count. Yeah, I'm gonna go with my classic strategy right here. Can't go wrong with my homies from the Fire Splinter. The damage output is fantastic. And uh, my first monster, the Living Lava, is a strong tank, especially for low cap mana battles. Come on, choose your team, my friend, and join this game. I hate uh, disconnects and uh, and of course away from keyboard players. They suck. Unless there's an internet problem. I mean, if you're playing a game, just keep your mind in the game you're playing, or else just don't play. And slow thinkers, slow thinkers. 
Well, in Splinterlands, it happens sometimes. I sometimes do choose my team in the last 30 seconds because it's just too hard to figure out which cards you need to use to make sure you're gonna win. As you can see, uh, Splinterlands, you can do anything after you pick your cards. Splinterlands is all about uh, planning a good strategy depending on your opponent's cards. Well, I think that's another win. I can't, I don't see my opponent joining this game. Come on. I need to wait. 2 minutes and 21 seconds. Every player has 3 minutes to choose their cards. So, a game could last up to 5 minutes. Okay, that's not very good, guys. Because uh, my opponent has magic attack. Oh shit. The misses are real. Oh damn, I lost this one, guys. Damn, miss. Okay, no problem. Off to the next game. Okay. Fire Splinter to the rescue. And, yep, that's my team. Give it a moment. That's my team. Come on, I don't want to wait two minutes again. Oh. I think that's slightly better, right? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, dude. Seems like we're gonna wait again. Slow thinkers. <coughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, well, seems like I've got to wait again. Okay, that's a tough team to beat. Shit. GG I'm gonna keep battling for a little bit Damn, I wasted my win streak I need to win my win streak back I need to win my way to a win streak 
Okay. I'm gonna play a bit aggressive this game. I think it's better if I just use these two cards and my creeping goose. Okay, yeah, that's my team. Hope we can win this one. Okay, that's a tough thing my opponent chose. Let's go! Nice. Okay. Nice. I think that's a GG, guys. Yeah. It definitely is a GG. I didn't even lose any of my cards. 26 points for me. Okay, let's hope for a win streak right now. Splitrance has recorded hundreds of thousands of dollars in tournaments. Yep, that's true. Twenty-six mana cap, no modifications applied. I think I'm gonna go with the same thing as before. Okay, let's see what's gonna go down. I think this is my win. Yeah, that's definitely my win. GG and back on the win streak 150 points well 152 points to silver 3 division ok summoners and masters that costs 4 mana or less maybe using battle that's what I'm talking about should I go? I think I should go with this one. Yep. I need a strong tank to start with. I think my best option right here is the Severus Manticore. This one. This one. This one and this one. Oh shit! Yeah, that's my team. Full melee damage. I also use the my ant miners. This card gains one health every time one of mine or my opponent's uh, monsters uh, die. So it's a really it could get really strong for just three mana. 
I won't be surprised if my ant miners reaches like 8 health in this game or 7 health. Come on, dude! Give me a moment guys, I'll be right back. Seems like uh, I'm not the win again, right? This is gonna be a tough game. Nice. Okay. This means that I just won. As you can see, my hand miners is 2 attack points and, and 8 health points. 9 health points for just 3 mana. Okay, GG, 20 points, win streak. Moving on. Okay, no modifications. I'm gonna do something crazy. Sig versus Knight, Luminous Sigil. I'm gonna use small melee. Uh, I'm gonna use melee attack monsters with low uh, mana and boost them with two attack. But thing is, should I boost? Yeah. Feral spirit and creeping goose. This is a weird tactic, but it might actually work as long as my silver seed knight doesn't die on the first turn. My masters are gonna get one attack from Silver Silk Knight and from one attack from my Dragon Splinter Summoner. Okay, my damage is catastrophic, as you can see, guys. For real. Twenty points for me. Moving up the rank ladder. What I love most about Splinterlands is that games don't last long. That's the best part, unless you have a, a disconnect or something like my opponents before non-flying monsters take 2 melee damage at the end of each turn okay so I guess I'll have to go with my Tyrius Palladium seal my monsters Maybe this will do the trick. Mm. That 
that's a weird uh, weird situation I think I'm gonna have to go with the iced pixie yeah and the truth speaker GG I think the chances of winning are on my side well I can't promise you that let me check out my opponent's team oh yeah I think I'm gonna win I'm not I don't think I'm pre I'm pretty confident I'm gonna win actually points there it is 72 points okay all I need is one more win and I'll reach uh, silver 3 division that's my goal for the day okay so this guy plays the life splinter a lot all melee attack monsters have the sneak ability <coughs> No, that's just too much. I'm gonna have to take a risk here guys yep that's my team wish me luck I think I'm gonna need it Okay, I don't think I'm gonna win this game. Let's wait and find out what's gonna happen. actually win this game not I might I'm gonna win this game very nice and actually pretty easy awesome okay 20 rating points to silver 3 then next battle is uh, the battle that will determine if I'm gonna reach uh, silver 3 or not there it is an earth splinter opponent yeah gonna have to go with my classic combo pure damage this one guys
Nice. Okay, GG. Silver 3 incoming! There it is. I'm gonna advance, guys. And this means that today's session is over. That's uh, Splinterlands for you. A really fun game. I've earned uh, some deck. I've uh, had a ton of fun. And in 7 minutes, I'm gonna complete uh, my daily quest and earn a couple of loot chests. The more I climb uh, the season, the more rewards I can get. You can check out the leagues right here. I'm currently in Silver League. Check it out, I'm gonna earn two loot chests. Uh, and the season ends in uh, approximately 13 days. Well, that's it. I don't wanna bubble. Uh, I'm gonna leave the Splinterland sign up link below. There you can find the fuck and anything, uh, any information you want about this game. Make sure you read. Uh, everything and ask me anything you want at the comment section below. Much love and hustle them crypto cardio. Peace.